inspiration and confidence through bike riding. I'm Jada Monterano in Carson, where Olympians are coming to teach our local youth how to ride a bike, but it's also fostering how hard work and determination can lead to a bright future. Riding a bike is a little difficult for six-year-old Sophia. She has trouble pedaling. <laughs> but she's determined to learn the skills to feel confident. You said that maybe I could practice pedaling today. Sophia is practicing how to pedal while also getting hands-on help with turning and braking, all from professional cyclists and even Olympians. There you go, now look where you're going. We're going left, following the arrows. Like Mari Holden, a Team USA silver medalist in cycling. She leads the Let's Ride camp hosted by USA Cycling that teaches basic skills and safety while also fostering confidence to our nation's youth. For me to be able to kind of share my love of sport with these kids and teach them that through hard work and dedication you can achieve your goals is super important to me. Let's Ride pops up around the country, but this is the first event in SoCal in partnership with local organizations like SAFE, the Bahati Foundation, Eastside Riders, amongst others. Mari knew she wanted to be an Olympian while watching the 1984 games in LA, so it's a full circle moment that she can inspire local kids like Sophia to reach for the gold as the Olympics are set to return to the city in 2028. To be able to share that kind of joy with a whole new group of kids and especially getting kids from underserved communities on bikes and getting bikes into their hands and letting them see the kind of freedom that it can bring to your life is really special for me. And if we find an Olympian here who gets inspired and wants to go further, I want them to understand they have the resources here to be able to do it. Maybe it's too early to tell if Sophia will be an Olympian, but her Aunt Gabby says inspirational figures like Mari set an example that no dream is too big with little hard work and determination. It's going to be something that's going to be motivating and it's going to be a great experience for them to remember when they get older. And I'm also going to encourage them to see if they also want to be in the Olympics in the future. But for now, she's just happy to see Sophia and her son Daniel become comfortable riding so they can continue at home for exercise and a new means of transportation transportation. Once they learn how to ride, I would like it to be a family experience where we could ride to school or even to get everybody moving and do something fun that's exciting for all of us. Bringing the joy of biking to more kids is a gold medal for all.